Okay, we're on course two of the day. I am going to stand still. There's not a lot of room around here. Hopefully, you'll get to see some of the action. There's a good climb over there that you can't see the bottom of it, but you can see the top. That's going through bonus gate number one. She climbed right up it. So where he's going right now is through gate number two. You can see Mike standing there. That's gonna be gate number two. These courses cover a lot of real estate. He's got a little bit of a lip there. And they have to go through the gates in the proper direction. And they can't go around a gate. It's called course flow. So there's a certain direction that they have to go throughout this entire course. It'd make it a lot easier if they could come down and then back up through it, but because they have to follow course flow, it makes the obstacles a little bit more difficult. Ooh, he slid a little bit there, but he's got his rear steer to get that rear over so he doesn't get that cone. He's twisted pretty good there, coming forward, trying to get that cone, just pivot around it. And he's off camera there, and I know the camera doesn't do it justice. So you can barely see right, I'm going to get my finger in here, right there is a cone. That's going to be gate number three. And I walked this course with y'all yesterday, I think. He got hung on his belly. There he goes. That rear steer got him off. He's lifting a tire. We saw that tire a lot further up in the air before. He has six minutes. So he's got to work that car around to get it lined up to go through three. You see Mike climbing down, you'll see how big that drop is. It's over Mike's head. So he's got to drop down and then come back up. He has about five minutes left and two gates to go.
he's got to come back up. That's gate three he's coming through right now. Now he's going to do a turn. He has about three minutes left. One more gate. Doing a front dig around. So Mike's going to watch that bonus cone very carefully. This is a tricky line. It has a off-camber steep stairway down. And he's got to go through a little ditch right before he goes over. So the trick is to not get hung up, to get up over it, not hit that cone, and to get down without flipping. So that's a lot to take in for one obstacle. He has about two minutes left. Once he gets down though, the gate is nothing. The gate's like almost right there. It's just getting down carefully. And you see how Mike has to get down? That tells you how steep it is. And he broke a brake line. He did get the cone. He has no brakes, so once you break a brake line, they're all tied in together. And that's it. I'm going to go check on that brake line.